What's going on you guys? Welcome to The Single Guy channel. My name's Lloyd, I am not The Single Guy. So today we have a question from a viewer. And he writes, hey Lloyd, I've been texting this girl for a little bit, but we stopped texting. However, she continues to follow me on Instagram. Whenever I post a story, she is one of the first people to look at the story. Uh, she does this every single time and she's been doing it consistently. However, when I reach out to her to see if she wants to hang out, she goes silent. What can I do? How can I turn this around? Why would she be looking at my Instagram stories if she's not genuinely interested? So this is a pretty common dilemma that I see in today's day and age, uh, especially with technology and everything. And uh, I'll be honest, there have been some girls that I have turned down that I have uh, watched their Instagram stories after. Okay, you can't just be looking at the Instagram stories. It's not enough. All right, yes, it can be an indication that she's interested in you. You know, if a woman is interested in you, chances are she's probably gonna be looking at your stories, okay? But if she's doing that and that's it, probably not enough. The biggest indication for him was the girl won't meet up with him, you know? I had a situation a long time ago. I met this, uh, long time ago. I met this girl at a New Year's Eve party. Very pretty girl, like we vibed a little bit, we talked. She was kind of shy and like, you know, I ended up getting her phone number. Uh, we texted for a little bit, but then she like kind of stopped. Her responses got less and less, so I just kind of like stopped texting her. And then um, on Instagram, she was like looking at my stories and she would be like, no joke, like one of the first three people to view my Instagram story, like every single time I posted. And then after she did this for a while, I, you know, I hit her up, asked her how she was doing, we would text and then I would invite her to something and then, you know, she wouldn't meet up. So I did this a few times and then I just, you know, just stopped caring and then, you know, we never, we never ended up meeting up, nothing happened, okay? This happened for a full year of her looking at my stories. Why did she do this? Probably because she just likes being on social media. Probably thought I was a cute guy. She probably thought I was a guy that, you know, she was somewhat attracted to. But at the end of the day, there was something going on. Maybe she was talking to her ex. Maybe she was just un, you know, just too scared to meet up. There are women who have like mental barriers and like they're going through some shit or whatever. The point is she wasn't down to meet up with me. And that's really what I look for and what I try and give to you on this channel is the practical advice. Like, what should you do about this? And the answer is the most that you can do for those situations is if you, if you get a girl who's like checking out your stories a lot, you can talk with them for a little bit, see if they respond and, and then invite them to something. If it's just her looking at your story since she hasn't shown any like other way of interest, there's probably not enough there to go on a date. And I'm not gonna like take time out of my calendar to make a plan with this person and have her flake. But what I am gonna do is I'll say, hey, you know, I'm gonna be at this bar, you know, later tonight or something like that, or I'll be out, you know, come meet up. And if she wants to, then she can do it, but I'm not gonna waste, I'm not gonna do something that I wouldn't already be doing uh, to meet up with this person. So you can convert those by doing that, but at the end of the day, you have, you can't stop just looking at the stories and think like, but why would she be looking at the stories if she's not interested? Yeah, she, maybe she thinks you, of you as a backup, maybe she's interested but doesn't wanna date you. Um, maybe she just likes being on social media, you know? For a lot of women, this is like their, t their television and you're just a channel that she was watching, but you know, a show that she just really isn't that into, <laughs> okay? So treat it as that. Uh, treat it as more of like, you gotta look at things as like a high value guy. You know, you can only put your time into so many things. And for me, her just looking at my stories is not enough for me to put time into it. And by the way, you guys, like just for me on my own personal note, I just don't wanna be dating someone who is spending a whole lot of time checking out like a guy's stories, um, you know, looking at his life and responding and texting to him, but in the end just doesn't wanna meet up. I mean, that's just not a valuable like way to be spending your time no matter who you are and uh that's not just that's just not very attractive to me so like if you want to be pursuing those kinds of women and you want to try and get them out um i would highly recommend that you rethink your standards because that's just for me in my own life that's not the kind of person that i want to be dating there are ways to convert these women but you don't want to actually be taking a whole lot of time out of your day and that's something that i talk about in my coaching program so if you want to learn about that you can take a look at some of my forms down below if you want to get coached by me there's a form you can fill out uh, or check out some of my links to my free trainings um, but yeah I, I would highly recommend that you stop uh, messaging this person because she ain't interested go for somebody who is going to text you back and meet up with you uh, not for someone that just looks at your stories all right you guys thanks for watching if you made it consider subscribing and good luck out there